Yeah. Yeah. Y'all know what this was, baby. Anyway, welcome everybody to one of the darkest Pokemon games that we have on the internet. Now, I know, you know, people like to talk about Pokemon Reborn, Rejuvenation. Some people will put like Insurgents in the mix, but look. We gotta talk about Pokemon Apex. This game is so underappreciated and it makes me mad. But because of that, we're here with the new update. This game is not new, by the way. It's not a new game. You got clickbaited, but there is a new update for this game, right? And since a lot of y'all are probably really new to the channel and have no idea about this playthrough at all, if you guys wanna go see the old playthrough, a link to that will be in the description section below. But today, I was thinking about we change this up a little bit because I was originally going to go in and I was going to go right where we started at the Sawsbuck Lodge where I have like three artifacts. I've seen 190 Pokemon. I've seen, uh, I've seen like, we're, we're like 17 hours into the game. I was going to continue from that, but I figured because we have a lot of new folks here, I figured that we go in and start brand new baby. I feel like that's just what we want to do right now. So, I have a proposition for you, right? If we can get between 500 to 1,000 likes, I'll do a whole, I'll do a series on it. You know what I'm saying? I'll do a series on a follow-up video. You know what I'm saying? If you want to go watch the old playthrough, you can. So you don't have to, you know, catch up to this. But as well, as well, if you all want 1,500 likes for the hard mode, I will literally play up to wherever we were in this video or wherever we end off in this video, just to go in hard mode for you all to do this. But for now though, we're gonna go into the regular setup. Uh, if you're interested in Pokemon Apex, link in the description section below. Uh, and let's get into it, man. I'm excited, bro, I'm excited. Prologue. Halcyon? Is that, is that a C? I, I can't, I can't see, hello? <clears throat> Misfortune may as well be my middle name picturesque unannounced i haven't been able to sleep well lately i know you must think i'm depressed or something but honestly it's not that at all i can't really describe it but it feels like there's something wrong with me i'm so tired i can barely think which am i again a boy now if only i can remember my name now the default character's name is griffin um, Nate, I think Nate is, or was it, no, was it Nate or Griffin? I know Nate used to be, uh, Sarah's old name because the, the creator of this game transitioned. So, uh, I know, I know she used to go by Nate, uh, but I don't know. I, and Brandon, that's a new name. I never saw that before. I'm going to rock out with my boy Griffin for story purposes only, right? Oh, I don't want to get up. Come on, sleepyhead. It's time to wake up. What's good, Dad? How you doing, dog? Hey, look at the squad. Look at look at my little room. I'm here, my G. An old homework assignment. I got an 82% on it. Oh, well, it could be worse. I mean, 82%? And when I was up in school, it was a wrap for me. Is this Dad's crib? And yeah, this is Dad's room with the two bad joints. Yeah. Did he, did he redo the beginning of this game? I think he did. Is that, a, is that a Moogle? I think it is. Hello, Dad. Hey, Griffin. Glad to see you're awake. Listen, I made some breakfast for you before you head to class. It's at your spot on the table. Don't be late today, please. Thanks, Dad. You'll probably want to put your running shoes, put on your running shoes, just hold Z to run. Thank you, sir. Let me get that Yazerski. Yeah. Is that a steak? His dad got him eating steak? Ah, delicious. Dad's cooking is the best. Yeah. Hello? Hello? Dad? Hey, Griffin, glad to see you awake. Okay. All right, never mind. Do I just leave? Oh, I gotta go. I just got out of here right now. Oh, hello. Nassim City Suburbs. There we go. There we go. I'm excited. Did he, like, redo some of this? Like, this is dope. I kind of don't remember all. I, yeah, I'm glad I'm replaying through this game again, because goodness gracious. <laughs> goodness gracious. I love how I'm playing a dark Pokemon game and it's October. <laughs> Let's get into it, man. Hello. I don't have time to wait. I need to get to class. Okay, so where's the school, though? Isn't this like the construction thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
The school should be down here, right over here. All right, the school is right over here. Yo, I really do like this. I really do like this a lot, man. Nassine High. There you go. First period is English, so I need to head to Mr. Barnes' class. Hey, my name, my last name is Barnes. Hey, is this Barnes right here, Mr. Barnes? I made it. I made it, though. Ah, Griffin, how nice of you to join us. Please take your seat. Looks like Griffin's late again. How many tardies do you have to... Yo, I, I, was, I didn't press A. I didn't press it. Whenever the class is ready, we'll resume our coverage of the metaphor of death in Shakespeare's Hamlet. So, as you can see, Shakespeare uses Hamlet to signify... And Hamlet lifts up a skull of Yurik and claims... Did I go to sleep? Hello? Uh... Griffin? Griffin! You're not falling asleep in my class, are you? No, sir, not at all. Then you'll have no difficulty telling the class what exactly Hamlet exclaims upon holding that skull aloft. He, um... Class dismissed. Don't forget to read the final act of Hamlet tonight. Griffin, I'll expect that if answer first thing tomorrow. I mean, ain't nothing but a Google search, my G. I'm sorry. What kind of dream was that? I don't know, but we're done with school. All right, time to head home for the day. Hello? Uh, oh, I forgot they have a skate park or like little skate rings here. I'll come back for that later. I noticed, yeah, hello. Hey, hey, Griffin. Rival, Sarah, how are your how are your classes? They were okay. Mr. Barnes was really grilling me today. I think he was pissed that I kind of dozed off in his class a bit. Yeah, he hates when people sleep in his class. Were you up late playing games again last night? Honestly, no. I've just been so tired lately. I can't explain it, but something just feels off. Sounds like you're coming down with something. Anyway, I have some homework to do. Come by later and we can play some games, okay? Got you. Got you, miss. Love you. Hello? Dad? Left my notes at home. Can you bring them to the lab after school? Looks like Dad left his notes again at home. Or at home again. I'll just pick them up and run by the lab downtown. If I need to check my text, just hit P to bring up my phone. Okay. I think these are his notes right here. This one right here. These are notes that Dad wanted me to bring him. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, let's go. Now, I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly, downtown is over here to the east of the city. Because that's where, yeah, we're in like the, the residential district. Yeah, 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 downtown is literally over here. So, like, did he make this place, or did she, I'm sorry, did she make this place bigger? I just so happened to find a soda pop. All right, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Xenocorp. Yeah, this is where dad, this is where dad moves, right here. Uh... What floor is he? Hey, oh, hey, oh. hey there. You need to sign in. Uh, I'll do this right now. Okay, you should be good to go. Thanks. All right, well, thank you. Where's dad at? Dad is... Huh. Where is Pops? Pop, is this you? Like Elvis. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's you. Yo. Hey, Griffin, thanks for coming by. I can't believe I forgot these notes. There you go. Yeah, no problem, dad. You know, things have been tough since your mom and I divorced, but I just want to say that I'm proud of you. Why are you getting so sentimental all of a sudden? I'm not sure. I guess just seeing how grown up you've become really brings a tear to my eye. It's a, par it's a parent thing. You'll understand someday. When I was about six or seven, my parents got divorced. I don't really remember much about my mom other than my dad really cared about her. I don't really know why they split up. Dad doesn't like to talk about it much mostly he just buries himself in his work but that was about 11 years ago anyway how was your how was school do you have a lot of work homework tonight nope i only have a bit of pre-cal to do i was gonna hang out with sarah later well i gotta get back to work thanks for dropping by i'll see you when i get home all right bye dad all right time to knock out my homework i better head home All right, here we go. All right, homework is done for the day. Time to hang out with Sarah. I apologize if we haven't really done much. This startup is really, really like character developing. So you kind of like have to uh, 
be patient. You know, you gotta, you gotta be patient with this game. This game gets really, really good. I'll, I'll cut off when we get when it gets to like the point, but I'm pretty sure Sarah Miss, how are you doing? Where is she at? She's over here. Yo, Sarah, baby G, what you doing, ma? You have great timing. I just finished all my homework for the day. Nice. I didn't have much, but I did have to run an errand for my dad. So, what do you want to play first? I got the new Smash Bros game if you want to play that. Hell yeah, of course I want to play that. Alright, I call dibs on Kirby. I'll be villager. Oh, he's a villager, man. Come on. No wonder you got heart problems, dog. Move out the way, bro. <laughs> you better not cry when I kick your ass. We don't allow crybabies in this house. Ha, you wish. We'll see who the real crybaby is. Okay. Hey, Sarah. Yeah, what's up? What's it like to have both of your parents around? It's all right, I guess. There's almost always someone in the house, but whenever I get in trouble, I get a lecture from both mom and dad. Why are you asking about that all of a sudden? Well, I was talking to my dad earlier and he got all sappy on me. I guess it got me thinking about my mom. I don't really remember much of her or much about her, like the way she acted or the person she was. All I have of her is the memory of her walking out. Plus, it never hit me until today, but I've never really known what it's like to have two parents around. It's always just been me and my dad. Don't get me wrong, I love my dad. He works so hard to support both of us. Sometimes I think he works a little too hard. I guess it I guess it just feels like sometimes there's a part of me that's missing. If that makes sense. I don't really know where I'm going with this. Just some random thoughts that hit me, I guess. I understand. I know that must be hard on you. I mean, it's not that bad. I, it just it just gets me thinking sometimes. Anyway, thanks for listening. Sorry for rambling a bit. It's no problem. I'm glad you told me. We've been friends for how long? You know you can come with me anything. Thanks, Sarah. It means a lot. Well, if you want to do something cool, take your mind off. I had an idea. What is a super awesome idea? Okay. Do you know about the abandoned house at the edge of the suburbs? I found a way in the other day. You want to explore it? That sounds real rad. Lead the way. Now, ah. Uh, Okay, Griffin, are you ready? I found a bar in the fence here that's loose. All we have to do is slip through it. Don't let the old man who works here catch you, though. I'll go first and clear the way. All right, be careful. Now, right here is where I'm going to end this off. Why? Because <laughs> this is where it gets dark. Here's the hole. We can slip through here to get into the backyard of the house. I'll lead the way. This grass sure is thick. I hope we don't step on any snakes in here. Don't worry, there aren't any snakes in the city. They're all afraid of me. All right. There you go. All right, welcome to the abandoned house, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said, this is going to be right in the soft right here. Make sure if you guys want to follow up video, you leave a like and uh, comment, subscribe, and all that extra good stuff. I'll talk to you all the next one. Bye.